Hey everybody, this is Summer with Da Naturally, and today we are talking about nipple blebs, nipple blisters, what to do. Well, why am I holding a bowl? I'm gonna tell you. I'm holding a bowl because this is going to help the bleb, blister, whatever mom has on the tip of her nipple go away. Those blebs can be filled with fluid, milk, and they are painful. So we need to quickly get rid of them. You should always work with a lactation consultant and a visual assessment to figure out what's actually the root of the problem of causing that bleb or blister. But this trick, boob water, will help soften it and hasten the bleb opening. Okay, so what do you do? Your nipple's hurting, oh, that's never fun. And you have this blister on the tip of it or the side of it or whatever, and it's just awful. You are gonna take this bowl and you are gonna fill it up with hot water. Not so hot that you're gonna burn yourself because your skin's going to be on the water, but hot water. And then what you're going to do is soak the breast, the nipple, the tissue in the hot water several times a day, okay? You're literally taking the water and placing your boob in it, okay? It could be on the table. You can't see the section, but on your table, and then just lean into it and sit there for five minutes, for 10 minutes. If you do it before feeding, that will help greatly because that tissue will be nice and soft and supple and more likely to open with breastfeeding or with pumping. Boob water can save the day. So it, when it opens, it's a good idea to, again, talk with the lactation consultant because there might be a need for a prescription ointment or something to help prevent further bacteria from growing on the nipple. So what have you learned today? If you have a nipple bleb or a blister, boob water can save the day. So that's all. If you like, give me a thumbs up. And if you wanna subscribe, go ahead and do so and you will stay up to date with me and all of my fun breastfeeding videos. You guys have a good day. See you later.